Hi you guys. Okay, so I decided to do a fun video that has been going around and it's baby names that I love but won't be using. And I'm not pregnant right now and some people are wondering if I'm planning on having a third child. And I think because in one of my vlogs I mentioned when I was at the OB that this could be my last time there getting like my six week checkup and everything and thinking like, oh, this is kind of sad thinking that this could be my last time. But where we are right now, we just don't know. We might have a third one, we might not. We just had a baby who's seven weeks old and we will see how things are you know, in the future when um, Maverick is about a year to two years old if we wanna try again. We just have to see what God has planned for us. But I wanted to share with you guys the baby names that I love but won't be using because so many people have asked me what other names I love besides Maverick. And would I share them with them? These are names that I won't even be using if we do have a third child. These are just names that I loved that Rob was just not, not loving. Okay, so I have a list and I have so many names because if you guys follow my vlogs, you know that it took us forever to pick a name and we did not pick Maverick's name. Like we didn't sign the birth certificate until an hour before we left the hospital. And I love the name Maverick. Rob was so like, uh, it's okay. It's not like his top choice, but I think he knew how much I loved it. And I think he likes it a lot now. I'm going to give you guys five boy names and five girl names that I love, but won't be using. The one name I really like and won't be using is Sebastian. I love the name Sebastian. I don't know. It's like not that common. I feel, I mean, I'm sure some places there's a lot of Sebastians, but around me, there's not many Sebastians. And I just think that name is so cute. And Rob just does not like that name. I love it. I think it's so adorable, but we will not be using the name Sebastian. The next name I've always liked is Marco. I think Marco is such a cute name and it sounds like a cool like guy's name, like Marco. I don't know. Me and Cassidy were talking about when we were deciding on names. Like I have to think about, okay, if this was my boyfriend, would it be like a cool name? Like, oh, hey, is Maverick home? You know what I mean? Like I just wanted to, like I had to say it like that to see if I would like it if it was like my boyfriend or husband's name. So that's kind of what I do. And I think it would be cute to be like, hey, is Marco home? Like, I don't know, I really like the name Marco. But again, Rob doesn't like it, I won't be using it. Another boy name that me and Rob both really like, but we just didn't like how it sounded with our last names. And I feel like some names just don't sound good with people's last names. And the one name that we really liked is Silas. I think Silas is such a cute boy's name. I don't know, I just really like the way it sounds and no, I just really like that name, but that doesn't doesn't go with our last name. We won't be using it. Another boy name that I like, but I feel like it's become a lot more popular is Ryder. Um, I think Ryder is a really cute boy's name, but I just know a lot. I just know a few Riders already that my friends have named their son, so we won't be naming our son Ryder. But it is a very cute name. The last boy's name that I love but won't be using is Maddox. We were on the fence between Maverick and Maddox, and I don't know if I mentioned this in. Um, the baby reveal video when we were deciding on Maverick's name we were also going between Maverick and Mavericks and I thought Mavericks was cool because it would have the X in it like I like but then we looked it up and actually Mavericks means the apocalypse is coming and I just didn't want that meaning for my son's name uh, but I love the way it's spelled I like the way it sounds but I just don't like the meaning and I'm really into like the meanings of names and stuff. Some people don't care. I do. Pax means peace. Sometimes we say peace of work, but I like the meaning of Pax and I like the name meaning of Maverick's name, which is um, independent and not a follower, which I really like that meaning. But Maverick's apocalypse is coming. It just doesn't sit well with us. Um, so I won't be using Maverick's, but the other name Maddox, I like Maddox, um, but Rob wasn't really loving it and some people were saying well Pax and Maddox both of those names are Angelina Jolie's kids her son's name isn't Paxton but it's just Pax and then they have a Maddox but I mean I really didn't care but Rob wasn't like totally into Maddox so I love that name but won't be using it now Rob has a whole different list of boy names that he really liked like Forrest and I forget other names River and I did not love those ones. So we're just talking about the ones I love but won't be using. <laughs> I have so many girl names. Um, the first one that I love but won't be using is Reagan. I love that name for a little girl. It, I think it's adorable. And I know a close family friend, 
they named their daughter Reagan. And I don't know. I just, I don't want to name my child a name that my, you know, a family friend's kid is named. But I love that name. I think it's adorable. So Reagan is definitely such a cute name if your daughter's name is Reagan. Okay, the next name for a girl that I love is Reese. I think Reese is such a cute girl's name. Same problem. Family friend. Their daughter's name is Reese. So we're not going to be naming our daughter Reese either. Um, even though it would be totally fine if we named them, they wouldn't care. And I mean, I wouldn't care at all if someone named their kid Pax. Maybe if like my, you know, brother or sister-in-law named their kid Pax, and then I'd care because my kid would always be around them. But um, I don't know. I wouldn't care if like a family friend named their kid after, you know, named their kid Pax in our Maverick. Another name I love for a girl, Rob does not like it though, it's Olive. I love the name Olive for a girl. I think it's so cute and I don't know, I could just see my little girl being named Olive. But then Rob's like, no, that's an Olive. No, we're not naming it Olive. We are not using the name Olive. Another girl name that I think is really cute is Hadley. I think Hadley is such a cute little girl's name, but I don't think Rob was like so in love with it, so I won't be using that name. But Hadley is a really, really cute name. I just think I wouldn't use this name because I have like other names over it, but I really like this as a girl name. And the name is Avery. I think Avery is such a cute little girl's name, and I don't know, I just love that name. So I hope you guys like this video. I hope it was fun. I thought it was cool to just share with you guys some names that I think are adorable and just so cute, but I won't be using for my children but I still think they are such cute names. And I have so many other names that I have um, thought of for our third child if we plan on, if we do have a third child, but those are in the vault for right now. And I guarantee you like most of them Rob won't like, but I will still, you know, try to, I will still try to convince him of certain names. But there are, if we do have a girl, there are like two girl names that are like my absolute favorite. And if we have a boy, We'll probably be in the same situation. Boy names are so hard because me and Rob have a very hard time agreeing on boy names for some reason. But I hope you guys like this video. Thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys all next time. Bye. He made a mess. Where is he? Hello. <laughs>